How you doing guys? Welcome back to the game. Welcome to Nothing To Something. It's an AIFC 24 Ultimate Team. We're trying to see what team I'm able to create by the end of AIFC 24 Ultimate Team by spending no FC points. But yeah guys, if you didn't see the last episode, please, please, please check out on my channel. I really would appreciate it. But actually, this is a team we've got so far, which I don't think is a bad team at all in my opinion. I mean, I know I've got a couple of lone players, but I think there's too many, too good lone players that I could not pass the opportunity to get them to a team and give them a go. But I see, last episode, we picked up Team of the Week, Olivia Giroud, which I think that's an amazing, amazing, amazing card. I really want to try and get into a team maybe at some point, or even just use them as a super sub. I think it's going to be a cracking, cracking, cracking card indeed to use in this series. But I see, we're going to jump into division rivals. The team he has got, he's got Courtois, Van Dijk, Thomas Muller, Ansu Fati, Rodrigo, Vinicius Jr. Oh my days, what a team amazing indeed, what a team amazing indeed. But he decided, as you can see, to bring his Courtois out so far up the pitch. I really wasn't too sure why, but I'm going to run down the wing with Vicayas there. As you can see, Vicayas is still going, and he puts into an empty net because I'm still not really too sure why he's going to bring his Courtois so far up the pitch in my opinion I mean I'm, I'm very very unsure why he's going to bring his Courtois so far up the pitch but I see he decided also to raise quickly so I'm really really thankful and really really do appreciate that free win there but I'm still not really sure why he's going to bring his Courtois over the pitch because I reckon he was fantastic people I reckon he could have easily 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 beat me yeah a fantastic team but I really do appreciate again that free win there from him deciding to bring his Courtois so far up the pitch and Kiaz went to an open net so I'm really happy that we got a free win now. We've got a, free, a win so far in Division Rivals in this episode. The next team we're going to be facing is he's got Eddie Militao, Tony Cruz, Sam Kerr, Rashford, Harry Kane. A cracking, cracking, cracking team indeed. But he's Harry Kane's running against it's Sam Kerr. He gets deflected away to Tony Cruz. And lucky enough for us, he mean he decided to try and chip it. And my keeper was able to collect the ball there. So lucky for us, we got away with that one. But now, oh my days, what a finish there from Rashford. A bicycle kick into the bottom right hand corner net. A lovely, lovely. Lovely finish there from his Marcus Rashford. Oh my days from the free kick. Lovely, lovely goal there from indeed. Cracking goal indeed to make it 1-0 for him. But now Sam Kerr's through. Sam Kerr gets it to Steena. And Steena, the Arsenal women's striker, makes it 1-1 for us now. She makes it 1-1 for us there with a lovely, lovely finesse shot into that bottom right-hand corner. But here we go. Sam Kerr's through. And his Sam Kerr makes it 2-1 with a cracking finish there. What a finish there from his Sam Kerr. But now a fantastic side tackle there from us. Now Steena's through again. Steena Steena still going, and Steena gets a double, oh my days, a cracking finish there from Steena, finish shot again, bottom right hand corner, gives the keeper no chance, lovely finish there from Steena, now it's Harry Kane's through and a cracking save from the keeper there to keep it out from his Harry Kane, oh my days, what a finish, I mean a save that was. <laughs> Indeed, there from my keeper. But now he's got a corner. It's Tony Cruz. He's going to take it. Let's see if I can keep it out. He's, he's, Tony Cruz whips it in. Harry Kane somewhere gets the ball. And it's Harry Kane slots it on me. Bad defending on from me there. Bad defending from me there. But I love things there from Harry Kane. Now Chloe Kelly's through for us there. Runs down the wing and gets it to Sam Kerr for the easy finish there. A lovely goal from there from Sam Kerr. Great play from Chloe Kelly to get it to Sam Kerr. And then we're through now with women's Chelsea Cam. It's still going now. She's still going. Can she put it away for us? Yes, she can. A lovely finish there from a women's Chelsea cam. Oh, my days. Make it 4-3 now in the 50th minute of the match. A lovely finish there. But now he's Rashford's through. He's Rashford gets it to Lewandowski. And Lewandowski's never going to miss that. A lovely finish there from his Lewandowski to make it 4-4. Four, four. We've got a corner. Kiaza whips it in. Gets it to Giroud. And Giroud's there. The super sub. Oh, my days. Olivia Giroud, the former Chelsea man. Oh, my days. What a header that was. A bullet header into the top right-hand corner of the net. But now he's hard through and his heart and makes it 5 5 as you can see I cannot defend for my life <laughs> <laughs> lovely finish there from his Haaland but now Olivia Giroud's through Olivia Giroud get it to Sam Kerr and now he's got a goal and assist a lovely goal there for Sam Kerr great play indeed from me there I think we make it 6-5 and now Delphine's got the ball Delphine gets it to Olivia Giroud and Olivia Giroud what a finish there from Olivia Giroud oh my days what a finish that is for us there a cracking finish there from Giroud finishes it into the bottom right hand corner Kiaza's through again Kiaza gets it to Mkhitaryan oh my fantastic block but Giroud's there again and he gets another goal oh my days Olivier Giroud what a player what a super sub in this match we won 8-5 somehow I have no idea what won 8-5 I must admit I say he had more shots he was a fantastic faith player and a fantastic team but somehow I just 
I amazingly won 8-5 and I have no idea how. <laughs> I must admit, I must have somehow just took my chances. But Giroud, oh my days, what a performance there from Giroud for us. Hat-trick and an assist. Oh my days, Sam Kerr got two goals and two assists. Two goals for Stina and an assist. And it's goal for me Chelsea women's cam. An assist for Chiesa. An assist for Delphine. An assist for Chloe Kelly. Oh my days, what a performance that was. I mean, I cannot believe I scored so many goals in that match. But I do think he was a fantastic faith player I do think they had a cracking 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 team indeed I reckon they could have easily beat me but I mean because they had more shots but somehow I was just able to take my chances which I'm really really happy I'm really happy to get another win in division rivals but so we're going to jump into another division rivals game the team we're going to be facing he's got Onana Thiago Silva Smalling uh, Diaz Asensio oh my days what a team that is indeed Haaland on loan but now Sam Kerr's through and we Chelsea come out oh, my days what a save there from Onana and unfortunately we could not get the second chance in there unfortunately for us but now is Ruiz is throwing any Ruiz oh my days Fabian Louise that power strike what a finish there from Fabian Louise for him but now Michelsi comes free is Chris Smalling um, tackles my Chelsea women's cam and now is Chris Small and gets sent off which is going to really really help us that's going to really help us out but now Chloe Kelly's going through here we go Sam Kerr to Steena and there we go we make it 1-1 one, one. now another goal for Steena there the women's Arsenal strike oh my day she's playing really really well for us right now fantastic finish indeed and she's through again and another goal for Steena she cannot stop scoring oh my day she's found a shooting boots another goal there for Steena the women's Arsenal strike a fantastic finish indeed but now it's Harlan's through and unfortunately he takes deflection and gets him but a cracking goal there cracking play from there and his Harlan makes it 2-2 now his Diaz is throwing it Diaz makes it 3-2 with a cracking finish there into the top right hand corner of the net a lovely finish there from his Diaz now Stina gets it to me Chelsea women's cam and now Sam Kerr's throwing Sam Kerr makes it 3-3 in the 58 minutes of the match a lovely finish there from Sam Kerr she cast got uh, she cast up scoring either fantastic finish indeed now his Harlan's throwing a cracking save there from the keeper he kept us in the game there now Sam Kerr gets it to Brownell and Brownell gets it to Giroud and Giroud's there I brought Giroud on again and Giroud's there to tap it on into an empty net again another goal for us oh my days fantastic play there from Giroud now Mkhitaryan to Giroud oh my days what a save from the keeper and now Rafinha's won it for us in added time there you go in the 92nd minute we make it 5-3 fantastic play there and Rafinha's there to put his home into an empty net after he's given me a, a fantastic save to keep Giroud out but luckily for us we're able to make it 5-3 and so I win the match I do think they're mean another fantastic Fantastic uh, EIFC player there. I mean, another fantastic team in my opinion. I mean. I know I had 17 shots to their 9 but I do think they were really close I mean, they had some really amazing chances and I think they could have definitely won this match in my opinion too but a fantastic win for us as you can say Sam Kerr got a goal and an assist a goal for Giroud two goals for Steena another assist for me women's Chelsea Cam a goal for Rafinha back from his getting his red card and Josh Brownell got an assist there fantastic 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 result indeed in my opinion another win for us which I, can, I, can, I cannot complain about three wins out of three I know he technically got one win given to us because he decided to bring his uh, his uh, Courtois out but I'll happily take it I mean I cannot believe I got three wins out of three in this episode which I'll happily 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 take indeed I think the team's playing fantastically well I cannot, I cannot believe how many goals I'm scoring right now. I mean, I, I can't believe because that's all, that's all I try and do. I don't mind winning or losing. I really don't. I just want to, I just want to try and score as many goals as I can. So I just think I scored eight goals in the one match, five goals in the other match. I'll happily, happily, happily take every day of the week. But actually, we're going to get some objectives. We're going to get some player packs, some player picks. I mean. I cannot complain at all. Hopefully, I can get some players that can maybe put into SBCs or even into a team. I would love to be able to make another team at some point with some I mean, players that I'll be able to pack out these packs, hopefully. Or even, like I say, get some players that I can put into SBCs and get some amazing, amazing, amazing players out of SBCs to put into a into new one to over this team or even a new team. I'd love to be able to do that, guys. But yeah, guys, who is the best player you have packed so far on EAFC24? Please, please, please leave a comment down below. I'd love to know. But also, guys, if you've got any tips or tricks that we get better at defending because you keep my defending right now isn't the greatest I must admit please leave a comment down below I'd love to know if you've got any tips or tricks that can we get, help me get better at defending on this game guys please leave a comment down below if you have uh, any tips that could help me but I said we can still get some objective here we've got on loan uh, Musial there and on loan Tiago that might be able to use eventually which is not too bad at all not too bad at all I don't try and use too many loan players because I'm not, too, I'm not a big fan of using loan players because obviously once I've used them I, mean, I can't use I'm only having gone around when I can't really afford to buy them. But I think at the moment, because I've got like a 24 game loan on Lucy, I want a 20 game loan on Bobby Moore. I think it's um, 
I think I really need to just give them a go, don't I, and see if they're any good. And maybe fingers crossed further down in the, in the series, I might be able to pick them up for a, a, actually like for, to keep them. But we're going to get some player picks there. Not too bad at all. Not too bad at all. We get the eight-one rated women's Man United centre back there. We get Moreno, the Aston Villa left back. I think we used to play for Liverpool. It's not too bad at all. Not too bad at all. Um, we're going to open some packs. We're going to get some uh, consumables now for the club. Get some gold paints, uh, gold nets, uh, some pitch lines, some gold sounds. Not too bad at all. Not too bad. Got some new kits. Cannot complain at all. Cannot complain at all at all. Got some flags to hang up around the stadium. Very very nice indeed. Cannot complain at all. Now we're going to open the first pack. We've got a gold players pack. We're going to get. We're going to get. We're going to get. Oh, we get the Spurs man. Benteke, uh, what, 82 rated, the former Juventus man, not too shabby at all, not too shabby at all, we've got a lot of players there, we can maybe put into SBCs, which is fantastic, fantastic, fantastic indeed, next pack, we're going to get, we're going to get, we're going to get the uh, Celta Vigo, is it Celta Vigo, I mean, I, I might have got my clubs mixed up, <laughs> but so we've got 80 rated CDM there, not too bad at all, not too bad at all, happens like that every day of the week, next pack, we've got a premium gold uh, players pack, we're going to get... Uh, left back, ooh, 83 rated left back there, women's left back, not too bad at all, not too shabby at all, I must admit, I mean, I'm happy to take them into the club, I might try and get them into a team if I can, but I think they'll probably end up going to SBCs, unfortunately, but I wish I mean I could get some uh, into a team, and then we're going to get another... Uh, American centre back here, women's centre back. Oh my days, 85 rated women's centre back now. That, that is fantastic, fantastic, fantastic indeed. Oh my days, 85 rated. That old, old ding dang do for us every day of the week. So thank you very much, AA. Now, next pack, we're going to get Striker. Oh, we're going to get the Juventus man. 83 rated. I, 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 I don't, I don't want to mess his name up. I know who he is, but I don't mess his name up. We also get Christian Eriksson, the United man. Not too bad at all, not too bad at all. And we've got an 80 plus times 10 rare goal players pack. Who are we going to get who we're gonna get we're gonna get boy munich we're gonna get oh 83 rated women's left winger there from boy munich not too bad at all not too shabby at all we also get the athletic and madrid center back locatelli oh not too bad at all if i must say so myself i think that's i think i'm some some decent decent packs indeed and we've got the 85 women's rated center back we've got 83 rated women's left back from the same club not too bad at all in my opinion not too bad at all but as you can see sam Kerr has got six goals four assists in seven games that's incredible 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 indeed steena has got four goals two assists in seven games she's trying to shoot in boots over sunshine She's playing really well for us. My Chelsea women's cam has got one goal, one assist in seven games. Very, very nice indeed. Chiesa has got one goal, two assists in seven games. Not too shabby at all. Not too shabby. All right. I reckon he'll get some more goals and assists in my opinion. My women's CDM from Arsenal hasn't got no goals, no assists yet. But I reckon she will do. Josh brownell has got one goal, three assists in five games, which I don't think is too bad at all. Not too bad at all in my opinion. Chloe Kelly's got one assist in three games. Not too bad at all. I think she's a really, really good card. I must admit, I think that really, I think that Chloe Kelly card is a really, really good card in my opinion uh, Bobby Moore's got no goals no assists yet but I reckon, well, I reckon he'll score some headers for me I really do Lucio's got no goals no assists yet but I reckon he'll score some goals from corners for me I do I honestly think so uh, Rafinha's got two goals three assists in five games fantastic indeed Delphine's got two goals one assist in four games and you see Olivia Giroud has got four goals one assist in two games he plays so so well as a super sub off the bench he's done incredible 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 indeed but I say I do think the team is playing really really well I think Chloe Kelly's amazing Steena has suddenly found a shooting boot Sam Kerr is incredible. The women's Chelsea cams really, really good. Delphine off the bench with a pace. He's a fantastic, fantastic, fantastic card too. I think the team is playing really, really well in my opinion. I think the team is fantastic. But yeah, guys, if you have enjoyed this episode of Nothing to Something, please, please, please smash that like button. Also, subscribe if you're new. Turn on the bell so you miss any videos like this on my channel. And I'll hopefully catch you all in the next video, guys. Bye, guys.